Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello, and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Santa Fe, New Mexico, with dumbass Elmo as he attempts to film in a detention center. Why would he do that? Well, maybe he wants to go back to what he feels like is his true home. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. What's going on, folks? Auditing America. I'm at the Santa Fe County Adult Detention Facility. We're gonna see if they respect our First Amendment right to video record over here. In is that like a law? Well, gee, dumbass Elmo, why don't you try actually looking up these things instead of like asking, oh, is this like a law or something? Look at this. There is a law on this kind of thing. It's a contraband law concerning uh, contraband in New Mexico correctional facilities, dumbass Elmo. I mean, good freaking grief. Use some common damn sense. But of course, that's just asking too much of somebody like you. Stop recording, please. Why? I'm a journalist. I'm asking you. I came here to do a video about the Department of Corrections and to request some uh, public records. Do you have an ID on you? Am I being detained? I'm asking for an ID. Am I being detained? You're on, you're on, you are on. Listen, you guys you need ID. You have, yeah. you don't, you have regular clothes. Can you have some respect? Can I talk respect now? No, you're not it's being right respectful. Speak. You're not letting us talk. All right, so. What I'm telling you speak. right now, this is private property. It is public property. It is private where do you get that? Where do you get that? This that the department the Department of Corrections is private property. I know. I am. I am. It's for my safety. All right. I don't know you guys. I know you miss it, Asselmo. I know you miss those sweat meat sandwiches, the uh, the hockey pucks they call pancakes, and well, the daily lockdowns that you have to go through. Yeah, I know you miss it. That's why you keep on coming to these places in hopes that, that they will let you back in. But guess what? They're not going to let you in that easily. You got to actually go out and, well, commit a crime like you did in the past to be able to let you back in. And, well, I would suggest something more than just uh, filming on their property because they're not going to let you in that easy that way. This is a who are you? Please stand outside. I'm I'm not refusing. I'm nicely declining to do that. Do you have a name? Of course we all have a name. What is your name, sir? What is your name? You guys are all giving me unlawful information. You don't own this property. No, you answer questions. That's why you guys have lawsuits on civil rights. Right? The Department of Corrections has lawsuits on civil rights violations. And you guys are making a big deal out of this. Is that what you're gonna do? Is that what you're gonna do? Is that police? Can we can we can, can we have some 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 human decency here? <laughs> you dumbass Elmo, who once kidnapped somebody and held them against their will and was imprisoned for it for a while, are. Asking for a bit of human decency, you're the last person who should be asking for that. I mean, come on now, dude. You are one of the lowest scumbags on the earth, and you go around asking for that? Oh, good freaking grief. Don't make me laugh. Are you a cop? I'm just waiting for my ride, bro. There you go. That's public record. So if you're taking a picture of me with your personal phone, do not delete it because we will be requesting that. So just know that you can't take pictures with your personal phone. You guys want to, you guys want to say all these, all these things like this place is, is private. All right. Just know that you work for us. We don't work for you. Your tax, your, your paychecks, what you eat every day at home comes be from our funds. Okay. Just know that we give you the privilege to, to work here. This is not private property. I don't even, you've never identified yourself. 
And you want my ID? Yeah, come on now, dude. I mean, even if you did pay taxes, you're like uh, less than 1% of uh, the overall income that these guys make. And your opinion, well, it doesn't really count in this situation at all because that minuscule amount that you do pay in, well, yeah... It doesn't give you the power to do anything here. It just, the argument just makes you look like a complete uh, blockhead. In addition, you being a convicted felon and having no job opportunities whatsoever outside of being an annoyance on YouTube, you really don't have much in the way of pull on any uh, property that's uh, a prison or anything like that. So you might as well just move along home because you have no say here. Police officer? No. How you doing? Are you a sheriff? How you doing? I'm Captain Rodriguez. What can I help you with? Lieutenant. Captain. Captain. Oh, nice to meet you. What's up? What can I help you with? Is this all because of a guy with a camera? No, I'm just wondering what you're doing looking inside his truck. It's public It's public property, isn't it? Okay, well, I'm asking you a question. I just told you, it's public property. I, I have the right to look at it, yes, right? Yes, you do. I'm just asking you what you're doing here. Okay, what are you doing here? I'm asking you a question. That's what I already I'm answered. Okay. Why are you looking at me like I'm that? Not, I'm just asking don't, what you're don't, doing. don't touch me. Hey, just don't down. touch hey, me. Look at me. Come why, on. why, why? I'm not, I have no ill will, by the way. Okay, so want... calm down. Calm okay, down, it's just a guy with a camera. Why you're looking yeah, just, you have to de-escalate. You're actually looking in a I was, I'm private, not. No, no, in a private citizen's car. That's fine, you want to look at our stuff, but what are you doing looking at a private citizen's I car? I could do that too, right? It's yeah. public. Oh, dumbass Elmo. You have no common sense whatsoever. Looking into somebody's personal vehicle with your little camera might be construed as doing something nefarious and might end up with you getting, well... Your ass planted in the parking lot because if somebody who owns that vehicle comes up to you and suspects you of breaking and entering into their vehicle, well, that might be detrimental to your health. So you might want to watch out for that. We're in a public place, yes. People have a right I'm to not, their privacy inside their vehicle. No, they, no right I, I can't go in there. That, that's called suspicious activity. Just that's well, how, 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 am I breaking the law by video recording? You can no. record all you want. Okay, there just you go. Asking what you're up to, that's it. Okay, but but, but why did you try to like go around I'm just and checking for you may safety you, of mine to see if you have any weapons on you? I have that right too. You're the you're the one that's got a weapon. I'm just checking hey, you. So 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 hold on hold on hold on. Let me get this straight. You're the stranger that shows up with a gun. And you are. Yeah, I just met. You. Okay. I just met you. You came to our place with employees. This is. This is. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. Exactly. I know for a fact where I'm at. This is a public place. So I'm not in private sure property. My employees are safe. Exactly. Because this, you guys are our employees. I'm oh come on now, dumbass Elmo! You should uh, be able to read into the nuances of this particular situation. They're allowed to have weapons. They're duly appointed. Uh, Law enforcement officers and corrections officers, they are allowed to have weapons on this particular piece of property, which is closed to the public, dumbass. You, on the other hand, are a convicted felon who is not allowed to have any firearms on him at all. Because, well, like I said before, you unlawfully kidnapped somebody and got your ass handed to you. In prison. So that's why I'm thinking that you're uh, paying a visit to another correctional facility. You miss the good old days of, well, having those nights alone with Bubba and the boys. My employees. No, 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 no. You don't I understand. Have the right to ask you. And, I, and, and I have the right okay. to refuse. Well, then you have the right to. I, I, no, I am. I have bu I have nice business here. Nice well, I am we're close, so you don't have no business. You're close. Day. So why are you work? Why why are you uh, why are you contacting me if you're if you're close? Because I work 24 hours a day. Okay, so you're not close. Our civilian staff does it. What's your okay. name and batch number? Captain Jose Rodriguez. I'm the only one here. What's the Third Amendment? Huh? I was getting I'm information on, on the Third Amendment. I'm, I gave you my information. No, I'm talking about the Third Amendment. Okay. Do you know it? I'm not going to go into that with you right now. Oh, okay. Have a nice day. All right.
You see how you guys react just to a guy with a camera? This lady was looking at me like she's never seen a guy with a camera before. Well, the Third Amendment thing was kind of out of the blue right there, asked Elmo. Uh, where the hell did that uh, come from, uh, asking about the Third Amendment? I mean, it was not about that in the very beginning, so I guess you felt like you were losing the argument and had to fall back on something, but it still came out looking like... Well, you fell flat on your face once again. Well, I guess that fraudulent script just didn't work out so well for you in this particular scenario. So you might want to get it revised at some point. I do. I do. They're public employees. Don't worry about them. They're going home for the day. That's fine. Good. Maybe they they should work somewhere else because we have we have you know we can't you can't be acting this way. No, they're off and going home and getting in their cars to leave. You have every right to be suspicious. All right, you're, all right, you're, uh, this is not suspicious. You're dismissed, sir. Have a nice day, then. Ha have a nice day. You're dismissed. So are you. Go home. Uh, you don't dismiss me. Yeah, that's right, dumbass Elmo. You are most certainly dismissed because, well, I'm sure if you didn't leave here, they would most certainly escort you off the property. That's for damn sure because you don't belong here. Because they don't need a multi-time loser to come back onto prison property unless they're uh, going to be housed there for a few years. So why don't you make like a tree and leave? Well, at any rate, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?